Here we've got the Milligram and the Millicef. Uh, both these boards are made with our topless construction. That means full carbon jacket layup. We've got glass impact pads under the bindings to stop dents from the sharp corners of CNC mill bindings. We have got Tangatech, which is a partial top sheet just around the nose and around the tail to stop chipping when you're touring. Both boards have a new addition this year which is powder pontoon, which is a unidirectional carbon stringer on the base side on each, each touring ski. And this just gives it a little additional bending stiffness to prevent the ski from snapping if you go over a snow hole and just to stop the ski from dishing when you're in deep snow and you're touring. The milligram is, as you might well know, the lighter splitboard on the market right now, uh, weighing in at 2.5 kilograms for the 158 and we also got sizes 163, 165 wide and the big boy 168. It is the same great shape as the Creamer which is a big mountain board, long radius nose, shorter tail, setback stance, a little bit of taper, long effective edge, really designed for powerful and playful free riding. And then new for this season is the Miller Surf which has exactly the same construction, um, but a totally different shape concept. Based on the Safari, it is a, as you can see, a powder shape with a mini swallow tail, 18 mil of taper, which means the nose is quite considerably wider with a lot more surface area than the tail. And then the board naturally balances and floats in powder. We have um, 3D shaping on the nose, we call it the 3D crossbuster nose. And what this does is in crusty snow, just a little bit of dishing, uh, just up from the contact point, helps the board to stop grabbing and stops it from feeling twitchy. It is a more fluid, surfy feel to ride, but what you choose is really about where you're riding. If you're riding, the majority of the time in alpine conditions where there's mixed snow conditions probably want to go for the milligram if you're riding in canada or japan say where you're almost guaranteed epic snow conditions then you don't want to leave home without the miller surf both boards are going to ride great in a variety of conditions it's just really about what you feel you're going to be riding more of so that's the two boards the miller surf and the milligram